thing puts out a crazy amount of volume for how thin it is um, this is from Taidu Kulalis the name or the theme of this or I guess the, the name of this tenor is the Paniana and it's a slimline tenor beautiful redwood on top this is uh, Lucky Strike redwood um, paired with the uh, tree mahogany as you can see is a little piece right here it's also on the back and sides i mean not back inside just the back besides this cherry uh the back beautiful um the tree mahogany and this was donated by luthier harvey leach and it's a stunning piece of wood this is going to maui both of the woods um on the top and back were donated by harvey leach and uh, it's one of the best looking woods. We've had a, a number of ukuleles that were made by the, you know, with the same wood combination. Um, it's always stunning to see this type of mahogany if you haven't seen it before. Um, you got a side port here. You got, I guess this would be the, the main um, port. It almost acts like a side port itself. You could see the... Um, Tide logo on the, the inside here it says number 307 Paniana and yeah radius fretboard you got this nice Honu shell inlay right up on the 10th through 12th fret it's very clean very well done it's the only thing that occupies the fretboard you got side dots you got 3, 5, 7, 10, 12 and 15 uh, cherry wood this is the sides also um, it's one piece with the neck um, faceplate is the tree mahogany as well with the tide logo inlaid in abalone these are uh, equipped with koto tuners uh, some of our favorite tuners very easy to use very durable all made in japan and low g tuning four carbon strings um yeah this thing this thing is really loud. this thing is really only about an maybe an inch and a half in depth but it sounds like a regular tenor Check it out. The Paniana tenor from Tide. Look at those.
two. Was that F? <laughs> 